All right, now to this. New at noon, dismissed. A judge ruled in favor of State Senator Louise Lucas to dismiss a petition recently filed against her to recall her position. The group filed that petition back in June, but Lucas's attorneys made arguments in court this morning. Ann Sparacco takes it from there. State Senator Louise Lucas walked proudly out of court this morning after a judge ruled to dismiss the petition recently filed against her. It was a question of uh, jurisdiction. That's simple. A group of voters out of Portsmouth and Chesapeake filed the petition in June. They believe the lawmaker misused her position after her presence at the Confederate Monument protest in 2020, where a statue was pulled down and hit Portsmouth man Chris Green, seriously hurting him. Lucas's attorney says the state senator found justice in today's court hearing. I think you know the judge understood, uh, unlike the the uh, individual who drafted the petition, he understood the Constitution. But the people who filed the petition disagree. If one thing, we got one victory out of this is to make people aware that w our state officials are not accountable to the people. That's the problem. The people spoke, but the law did not hear. The judge ruled in favor of the attorney's argument saying the court doesn't have the authority in this case. The Commonwealth's constitutional law says a state senator must only be removed by the vote of two-thirds of the state Senate. Because Lucas was cleared of all charges of conspiracy regarding the Confederate monument back in November, state law says the voters' petition cannot recall her position. Our team asked Lucas for any comments following this case, but she did not want to speak on camera. In Chesapeake, Ann Sparacco for 13 News Now. State Senator Louise Lucas also filed a $6 million lawsuit against former Portsmouth Police Chief Angela Green, who filed the conspiracy charges against the lawmaker last year.